There are three drinks that can stop your blood sugar from rising after eating starchy food. So the first thing that you can drink is lemon or lime juice. Either one is fine. But it will tax your liver and reduce the ATP concentration in hepatic cells. It will also glycate. When you take acid with your starch, it stops the salivary amylase from working. So the starch doesn't get broken down and you don't get the glucose going into your blood. Another thing that this acid does is that it slows down the rate at which your stomach empties, which means that you feel fuller for longer and you're less likely to snack. Delaying stomach emptying and filling up on fibre and resistant starch isn't really the best way to go about nourishing yourself. If you're feeling full, eating things that don't contain nutrients, well, how are you going to properly nourish yourself when you don't feel like you have an appetite to nourish yourself? The second thing you can drink is vinegar. And I'm sure you've heard a lot about apple cider vinegar, vinegar with the mother, raw, filtered and all that. It really doesn't matter. Any kind of vinegar will work. Don't drink vinegar, just drink water. If you're taking vinegar that's raw and unfiltered, that means that it has the mother of vinegar, which acts as a probiotic, which can help if you've got gut issues. If you've got gut issues, I would really recommend you don't consume things we can't digest. Trust me, I lost my colon in my 20s. It's just not your bag. Another thing you can drink is wine. No, don't drink poisonous acid aldehyde. Drink water. Yes, wine is a little bit acidic, but there are other ways in which it brings down your blood sugar. When you're not eating, your liver breaks down the carbohydrates that it's stored away to give glucose. It also produces glucose from your protein and your fat. All this is to make sure that your blood sugar never falls below a certain level. Problem solved. There's no need to eat carbohydrates. When you drink alcohol, alcohol takes priority over anything else in your liver. So your liver will break down that alcohol first. It must be our preferred energy source, right? 